In today's video, you will see me open up the best three Division Rival rewards on the brand new EAFC. I'm talking Division 3, Division 2 and the ultimate Division 1 rewards. But is it really worth it? Division 3. Is this worth the grind or not? What do we get for Division 3? 50k pack, Jumbo Premium Gold Players pack and then another Jumbo Premium Gold pack. Let's go for a 50k first. 50k pack in Division 3. Is it worth the grind or not? That's going to be Grimaldo. No, it's not. Jordi Alba. Jordi Alba? What rate are you this year, mate? 83? Oh, he's had a bit of a downgrade, isn't he? This is not going to be a 50k pack to remember, is it? Anybody else in the pack to give us a smile? Absolutely not. Another pack in Division 3. Can we find a walkout? I thought that was going to be Puskets for a second then. Atletico Madrid, CDM. This is a difficult watch, lads. This is a very difficult watch. 84 rated Coke. Oh, and nobody else in the pack as expected. Last pack, Division 3. We need a miracle. Fabinho. He was a walkout last year. What's he this year? 84 rated with 59 pace. He moved to the Saudi League and he got a massive downgrade for going. Same as Ronaldo. That's Division 3, guys. Anybody else in the pack in Division 3 or is it just a complete waste of time? Um, yeah, it's a complete waste of time. Division 3 has paid us that. I'm worried about what's in Division 2 and Division 1. Is Division 2 any better? I really hope these deliver. What do we get in return? We get a Jumbo Premium Gold Players pack. We get a 50k pack. We get a Rare Electrum Players. And we get a two Rare Gold. These are all tradable again. We've gone for tradable rewards. Right, first pack. Division 2. Is it worth it or not? Dutch. Send them in. Is it Gravenberch? I think it is going to be Gravenberch. Liverpool. He's, he hasn't got a great rating, to be fair. I feel like Gravenberch deserves more than this rating that he's got. It's not a great rating, is it? For a player of his quality, I thought he'd have a better rating, but he doesn't. Jumbo Premium Gold Players Pack for Division 2. Germany. Hello, Rudiger. Rudiger. He was a walkout last year, wasn't he? Is he a walkout this year? No, he's an 85 rated. What are some of these downgrades? What's happening to some of these downgrades? I'll tell you one thing, though. He sells. He's tradable. And he must sell for coins. He must sell for some coins. Rudiger. I mean, it's 80,000 coins that I wouldn't have had. So that's not a bad pack, is it? That's not a bad pack at all. 50k pack next. A walkout would be superb. Tony Cruz. Tony. Tony. Good the good. He's a walkout, I believe. Good the good. Hello. Is it a double? Oh, he's got a double. It's only 286s. But it's still a double walkout. Double walkout from a 50k pack. Now, that is what I'm talking about. About time we get some decent rewards. That's what I'm talking about, eh? Double walkout from a 50k pack. And there might even be more. No, there's no one else in the pack. Tradable 50k pack, two walkouts. You can't complain of that, can you? You can't complain of a bit of luck like that. What we got this time then, Brando? What we got this time? Italy, centre mids. PSG, is that Verratti? I thought I just got another walkout. I have. Division 2 rewards is actually pretty good. Division 2 rewards is all right. Three walkouts and a Rudiger. Overall, I can't complain of that, by the way. I can't complain. For Division 2, I cannot complain of that. That is not bad at all. Division 1 rewards. Are they the best rewards in the game? Or is it all just a bit, a bit of a lie? You get 100k pack, prime gold players pack, a rare gold pack, and we get some XP as well. 100k this is. Our best chance of a walkout. Australian left mid from Arsenal. That's got to be a, a woman, no? We get Ford, 84 rated. A 100k pack? I mean, I've got a very bad feeling we're not going to see a single walkout from this. I've got a really bad feeling we're not going to see a single walkout. I don't think we're going to see a walkout. Division 1 rewards these are. Okay, we do get two Team of the Weeks, but they're not great Team of the Weeks, are they? 84 rated, and the rest of the pack is terrible. The rest of that pack is terrible. That's a 100k pack, by the way. 100,000 coin pack, and that's what we've got in return. Please a walkout, EA. That's not a walkout. That's to sober. More like to so bad. That is a terrible pack. 
Give us a reward. We've just grinded the game out. What a terrible set of packs these are. 12 players in this pack. Is it any good? French. Mbappe would be a miracle. Mbappe would be a... It would be a miracle, but it's not going to happen, is it? And there you have it, guys. Is Division 1 worth the grind? No, it's not. No, it is not. Honestly, to get to Division 1 right now at the start of the game is so difficult as well. Like, you're playing against pro players all the time. And then to get that back, um, Division 1 wasn't great, was it?